How's it going guys? Um, today I'm just going to show you a very quick tutorial of how to share a private repository with specific users. So what I have here is this is a kind of this is an account I have um, Tim1989 and I have three images Lua test which is public, bash test which is public, and then addition which is private. And what I'm going to do is from my local um, environment here, my local uh, Mac OS terminal, I'm going to log in as a different user and I'm going to start trying to request these images. I'm going to show you guys how that works and how to share them. So if I log in, Docker login, and I'm going to log in as MacGyver Technology. So not that user, Tim1989, but a different user. Okay, so I'm logged in, just running some Docker commands here, listing out the containers and images. I have the Ubuntu image local. Okay, cool. So I'm logged in here as a different user, MacGyver Technology. And as MacGyver Technology, I'm going to start trying to request this user's particular images. So let's start out with Lua test. And let's see the tags here. Okay, so I'm going to request, I'm going to pull docker pull tim1989 lua test tag of three and because it's public everything's good and we start downloading the image I'm not going to finish it but everything's fine when we do that so what happens if I request a private repository and again this would not be displayed in docker hub typically unless I was logged in I'm just trying to show you guys how that works so let's Let's see what happens if I try to request Tim1989 addition. Uh, let's see what tags are available. One, okay. All right, so as MacGyver technology, I'm trying to pull this Tim addition pro program. And it says not found. And the reason is because it's a private repository, so only this user, Tim1989, can access it. But what if Tim1989 wants to share it with MacGyver Technology, the user that I'm logged in as right now? Well, it's easy. You just come over to Collaborators, and then we go Add User. So MacGyver Technology. And again, we're only adding them as a collaborator for this one image. They're not going to have access to every other um, image that you have. So we just added a collaborator and that is who I'm logged in as here. So let's see what happens if I re-request that private image. Now we're able to download because Docker sees that we've allowed this particular user to download the image. So that's how you can share um, a Docker image with uh, different collaborators and different users and it's pretty straightforward and it works really well. So that's all I got guys.